Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Couple. Or not, I always want to say Couples Play because I always introduce the Couples Play stuff too. But uh, this is a prison inside of a prison. This is uh, Flog Play's murdered soul suspect, and I am investigating a new scene. So, why would you need to cage someone already backed into a tiny cell? Okay, <clears throat> let's go ahead and reveal. Whoa. Uh, let's see. Stern. Uh, judging. Accusing. Oh no! You claim righteousness, but you know your guilt and cannot deny your punishment is due. All right. So there's a righteous man, and there must be somebody right here. It's the girl. Pleading. Uh, imprisoned. Duh. You stood for justice. How is this just? All right. What's this? Who drew this? The bell killer symbol was once drawn in the cell, but by whom? Hmm. Extinguish light. I bet all these candles did nothing to combat the darkness down here. Okay. All right. What we got here? Oop. Bound. Okay, so these were shackles, obviously. Dungeon more than a prison. Okay, that's six of seven clues. Uh, whatever I'm missing must be really small. Oh, there it is. No rest for the wicked. Prison bed. It sucks. Okay. Let's go ahead and go in here. Let's find an answer. What happened down here? Uh, imprisoned Abigail. Righteous man. Um, symbol in the cell. Okay. Yeah, that must be it. But you know your guilt and cannot deny your punishment is due. I thought you stood for justice. How is this just? The courts are not a place for your murderous whimsy. You are a corrupt heathen. The families of those innocent souls you executed through false accusation of witchcraft will exact their righteous justice tonight. False accusation? What is that nonsense you draw? Oh, wow, that. My mark will burn like a brand in the flesh of this town. It takes me to the ends of eternity. I will personally make the bell toll for every witch in Salem. Wait just a second. The guy who killed me is... Abigail. She might be the bell killer. How is that possible? I gotta get out of here and figure out how to track her down. Holy shit! Well, that is a twist. Um. Alrighty then. Um. Abigail is the bad guy? Um. I didn't see that one coming. Holy hell. I'm looking for the last couple pieces of this. Uh, story. <clears throat> oh, shit. Not Rex. Rex is missing. He could be going down right now. Where'd you take Joy, you asshole? Where would Abigail take Joy? Probably the gallows. Uh, killer's instrument of death. That makes sense. And so that would be... Ah, 
I am failing! I failed. Now I'm just gonna select things. Oh, okay. Well, there you go. So she's taking her to the gallows? Instrument of death, meaning her death, where she was killed. The gallows at the museum. So it's all gonna boil down at the museum. All right, I completed the Bell Killer investigation. Now I need to track down the track down Abigail and see what the hell's going on here. All right. So, I didn't find the last couple pieces of that story though. That's the thing that troubles me is that I kind of want to find them, but I'm going to go ahead and continue on and go back to town and then head on off to uh, the museum to find out where Abigail is because I want to finish this storyline for you guys so that we can finish this game and I can move on to something else. I love this game though. I mean, this game is definitely a lot better um, than a lot of people have said. And if you find it on sale somewhere, you should definitely play it. I mean, it's definitely something that anybody who's a fan of like horror related games will love. And I'm a, I'm a huge fan of horror games, and so I absolutely love this stuff. Now, where the hell am I going? Oh, I gotta go this way. Never mind. I know that there's a whole bunch of stuff probably all over the place, and I'm probably missing some of it. But I'm gonna I'm I'm basically playing so that I can finish the game for you guys and then if I want to I'll come back and do the side stuff later. Um I'm not gonna really be too much of a completionist about this game because I'm playing it for the channel. Um I mean I know we're doing side missions and stuff like that in yeah, but Okay, so I think that said that before proceeding I should probably save because this is going to be the last thing, so I'm trying to kill someone who pretends there's some grand justice behind it. That just makes it all a more twist. Uh oh. But who is she possessing? Cause she can't be doing that herself. She has to be possessing someone to do that. Alright, so I I got to the museum. Now I gotta get around these things. Alright. There we go. Uh oh. Joy! Ronan, help! Not another step. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. She's it has nothing to do with her, Abigail. Oh, but it does. For three hundred years we have executed the witches who corrupt our fair city. Down there. Those who try to mask their demonic contract and leverage powers they should never possess. Oh God! Don't you dare compare me to her! <laughs> easy, easy. Put your hands up! Help! Don't do anything stupid. Hands up! Stop what you're doing. Hands up! Do it now! Uh oh, that's not good. Oh crap! All right, all right then. Rex, you piece of shit. What are you doing? Not now. This was you. Once you're getting closer to the truth. Ronan, do something! Wait, what? I'm here. I'm here. Okay, that didn't work. 
All right. Well, that didn't work. All right. So I okay. So I have to. No, I don't want to exit. I have to save Joy, but I have to do it with some clue, and that that that's gonna suck. Okay. So B skip. All right, so I got 20 seconds to run over here and figure out what. Okay, so what would do it? What would do it? What would do it? What would do it? Okay, no, 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 no. All right, so you get one choice, and then she dies. So this is going to take me a couple of tries, obviously. All right, so what would stop Abigail from killing her? Is it something to do with her mother, maybe? Okay, okay let's skip that. Oh, no! Uh, well, that didn't work. I got killed that time because I was stupid and I walked forward. All right. This, sh this might just be the last episode, guys. You guys might be watching the last episode of Murdered Souls of Bugged. Unless they do more, um, unless they do like a DLC or something like that, then I might play through that. All right, what we got here? Okay, come on, come on. What? What would do it? Uh, hiding witness, possible target, Joy's verse, my only lead, original target, Joy, killer's identity, partnership, a witness in custody. No. What is going to stop her? I don't understand. Okay. How many times is she gonna die? How many times is she gonna die? 58,000 times because I suck at this game. <laughs> all right, all right, come on. Come on, let's skip it, and then we'll move on. Come on, we can do it. What would stop her? I'm trying to think, like... Uh, possible target, original target Joy, Joy's verse, the witness in custody, hiding witness, Witnesses, mother's note, killer's identity, powerful, powerful scream. That's it. Yeah. If she screams. Oh, that blew Abigail right out of her. Jeez. It's over, Abigail. It's a ghost fight now. How Okay. No. 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 Okay. That didn't help. Okay, so how can I stop Abigail then after God damn it? <laughs> what's gonna stop her? Okay, I know I know what's gonna do that, so then how do I stop her? Influence, powerful scream. Roar! Alright, B skip. Okay, what? I don't understand what's going on. Okay, there we go. Oh, grab her. Yeah, there you go. I thought I might have to just run up to her, but I didn't get the option to do anything. Uh oh. I know the truth about your death, but I still don't know the truth about mine. That's true. Did you use Rex to kill me? Did you use Rex to kill me? Rex was my most influential. The most respected, the most feared official in town. Of course I did. So Rex killed him under the influence of Abigail. How can Rex be the killer? How could Rex have done it? Rose's killer had blue eyes. Why did it use the same killer? 
killer for every murder. Oh, wow. Baxter. No way. Why did you kill Baxter? I eventually kill all the killers I use. Especially the ones who get close to the truth. So, Baxter was looking for information on what the hell happened. Why'd you kill me? I wasn't close to the truth in the apartment. I wasn't one of your killers. Why did I have to die? That's a good question. She's got a sadistic smile. Okay. Okay. Oh my god! No. I wouldn't. Holy shit! She no. used him to kill- No, no, I, I wouldn't. How could I? Holy shit! Oh my god! I did not expect that twist! Um... If I'm going out, you're coming with me. Uh oh. Get out of there, bud! All right, well, that's crazy as hell, but holy crap. So she possessed Ronin and made Ronin kill the girl in the chair. That's the reason why the girl was so scared of him. What in the hell? No, oh God. That scared the crap out of me. We all got a dark side, sometimes obvious, sometimes not. If we're lucky, we keep our dark side hidden. By law, Rex was a killer. The law doesn't always see the truth. Fortunately, Joy did, and she would never press charges. <laughs> she might even help Rex cover his tracks. One thing's for certain. Yeah. She's a better person than I was at that age. A kid who deserves forgiveness. She's paid her dues. And committing a few small crimes searching for your mom? Huh? Even the coldest cops would forgive those. Mom! <laughs> Hasn't been a bell killer murder since the night Abigail met her final end. But the case never officially closed. But memories fade, time heals. With luck, Salem will move on and find peace. Well, there you go. That's good. Death repays debts, my father always said. Forever I believe that. But truth be told, this life ain't over until you're honest about what you owe. Set everything right. Settle your debts. Only then can you move on. Ronnie? <laughs> That's awesome. Well done. It's a good ending and a very good... It's a very good ending for this type of game. Very succinct and you get the feeling that he actually had a very good ending. That had a lot of twists toward the end that I was really 
actually genuinely surprised about. So I am glad that I played through this game. I'm glad that you guys went through this with me, and I'm glad that you guys enjoyed it. I hope that you did, and if you did, remember to hit that like button and comment to the videos. And I'll tell you what, at the end of this video, you should tell me what I should play next. So Murdered Soul Suspect is all done and over with. You tell me what to play next, and I will play. Make sure it's a single-player game, because I'll play it by myself that way. Dijelin can continue playing her games as well, and we can continue doing the uh, couples play stuff. So I will see you guys in another video. Remember to hit that like button, comment, and subscribe. See you later, guys. Goodbye! Thank you very much for watching that video. Click in the upper left to subscribe, and then check out Unturned. I need pants. I don't have any pants. <laughs> check us out on Google Plus and Twitter for all the new updates for the channel, and then check out Five Nights at Freddy's. Um. <laughs> also, make sure you click on the Brain and Behavior logo there so you can check out the charity drive that we're doing for them right now. Also, thank you very much, and goodbye, everyone.